listen up. The rendezvous point is the shingle at the top of the beach. Use those, those depilates and keep moving. Do not stop until you reach the shingle. Clear the boat! Go! 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 We need to get to that shingle! Okay, short sprint. Keep that coming.
We have to silence those 88s. Sergeant, round up your men. All right, listen up. First squad, prepare to move out. pressure off our beach head. Enforcement underway. Excellent job, men. Sergeant Conti, get on the radio. Tell HQ our draw is clear for the tanks to come ashore. Secure the perimeter and dig in. Inform Dog Company that we are in position and waiting for them to come offshore. Seven hundred men died that morning on that uh, tiny strip of sand. Another fifteen hundred wounded, three hundred missing, dragged under the waves. Pearson, Williams, Krasinski. All good men. By sunset, 
Over 156,000 men had come ashore. The invasion had begun. Or, as my CEO used to say, hell opened its gates. The night before, the largest airborne operation in history dropped three divisions of paratroopers behind enemy lines. And their objective was to seize major roadways and prevent a counterattack that could jeopardize the entire invasion. Success on D-Day depended entirely on these men. <laughs> 